Hi, welcome to my channel or back to my channel. I'm Brooke Amoka, if you're new here. And today is Tuesday, September 24th, and I am home alone for the first time in a while. And if you're new here, I'm currently living with my parents until my boyfriend and I find a new house. So, right now, I'm cleaning because I'm never really here to do that. And I like to clean when I can blare music, do my own thing, and all that jazz. I also need to make something for dinner. I did have some Pop-Tarts right now. I was really hungry. Cause I had, okay, I just need to start eating better. So if you have any tips and tricks for a picky person, leave them down below because I need them. I just need to start doing protein shakes again. I did that when I was in high school and it was pretty good. I'm so getting sidetracked right now. But I thought that I would film a little what I do when I'm home alone, mostly clean. <laughs> and I need to figure out what to eat. I'm washing my bedding because I haven't been here on the weekends to do that. And then my work clothes. And I'm just so excited. I love doing this shit when I'm alone. I just feel so much better. I get to do whatever I want, however I want. No one can judge me. And no one can be watching TV in the background while I want to play music. <laughs> I would never do that when someone's home and wanting to watch something or whatever. But I'm going to now. <laughs> I would feel so great if one day I eventually get to a point where I could help my parents out. Like getting new stuff for them, like brand new towels, brand new pots and pans that my mom's been wanting forever and organization skills and shit and bedding like look at this this is older though this is why i'm switching it out also plus i don't want it even though i'm only going to be here for like a month or two i don't know we'll see this whole house process is giving me gray hairs but that's just a bunch of different reasons why <laughs> this video i already know it's gonna be all over the place. But if you're sticking along, thank you. <laughs> Anybody else have like parents that keep their shit like this? Like these are years older, maybe even older than me. Also, do your parents, did they ever mop the floors constantly? Cause mine did not. <laughs> I feel like that's a normal thing nowadays is to mop your floor floors constantly and vacuum. Which they do. My mom does vacuum all the time. But mopping, nope. We only have, at my parents' house, hardwood floors in the kitchen and the entrance area and then downstairs, but that's cement. Like, does anybody really mop their basement if they have one? If it's cement? I don't know. Let me know. But, I can't wait to put new bedding on. Also, does anyone else get where... Like, they get neck cramps if they sleep with pillows, like even one pillow sometimes. Because I do, and lately I've either been sleeping with a really, really skinny flat pillow or none at all. Anyways, I need to go charge this camera. Okay, first of all, those sheets did not work out on the bed. They were too small, so now I've just got to use the holy ones for now, which is fine. Just got to wash them. And second, I was just bawling my eyes out <laughs> at a wedding video. So if you've ever seen Brooke Bush on YouTube, now Brooke Epps, she just posted her wedding video, and I bawled almost the whole entire time. It was so good. Definitely recommend definitely go watch, but... Maybe have a box of tissues near you. <laughs> I ate leftover spaghetti for dinner and now I'm gonna finish my laundry. Okay, so honestly, the night didn't end up like I thought it would. It turned out to be not really a home alone video anymore. I just ended up still doing laundry, which I'm not even done yet. And cleaning out my junk drawer because I had the energy to I open it. I think I got ADHD to be honest because I was doing one thing after the other and just forgot what I 
want it to get done or whatever. Anyways, I'm gonna shower and then do a little face mask later, but I wanted to show you guys the stuff that I use in my everyday shower. But I'm not gonna shave tonight, but I'll show you guys what I use. Just in case you're curious. I'm gonna start with the stuff that's in here. I didn't get it all out yet. But I use the EOS shaving cream because it helps with my skin. My skin breaks out a lot with like a lot of the creams and stuff. My toothbrush. And this sensitive Colgate toothpaste. I was using the Hello white one. It's white with a blue logo or whatever. And I loved it, but my teeth are super sensitive right now because I need to go to the dentist, so I've been using this. But I still love my Hello one. And then uh, my hair, I try to go days without washing it, but it just like gets flaky and gross. So I use this shampoo and this conditioner with the scalp massager. And then from Vanilla Swirl on TikTok, I use this face wash after this face wash this is like an oil based one and that's just like a foaming one but i want to get the one that's for like um dry skin because in the winter my skin gets pretty dry and i use a men's razor key for me because my skin literally gets irritated with the smallest thing but i also use a vanna cream moisturizer with what oil is it? I'll show you guys when I get out, but I'm gonna go shower. Okay, I'm literally about to go to bed soon. I'm so tired, but I just wanted to say thank you guys for watching this video. First of all, I will show you this product, but I use this Vanna cream for my face mixed with this castor oil, which I doubt it really matters which brand you get, but. It's been working pretty much for me, but that is her night routine mostly, and I kind of want to try her products she uses for her morning routine. And then every now and then, I use this, which has lasted me a long time. People who go through shit like this, like, no tomorrow, that's wild. Crazy. But disregard this mess, okay? While I'm living here, I kind of have, like, no storage. Like, look where I'm... <laughs> Where I put these pillows because there's no extra storage. Um, I did not end up finishing these sheets. This night did not go how I thought I was going to, but you know what? That's okay. Because that's <laughs> I am going to pick up a kitten, a new little kitten for my boyfriend's set um. It is so cute, it's gonna look like one of our current cats that we have right now it's literally i'm getting it from the same person she's so oh my gosh stinking cute she literally has thumbs okay thumbs ready oh, look at okay anyways i might record going to get her i don't know if i'm getting her this weekend or next but stay tuned i love cats y'all if i could have a full-on cat barn like cat farm thing oh my gosh i would i have so many dream cats that is i just never knew i was like this until i moved out and then got my own cats and then just love them i love them so much even though like my hand looks beat up from my one because she loves to play fight like she loves to like hook on your arm <laughs> and because she like bites our other cat because that's how they play she thinks that's how like you play with humans too so my hand's a little scarred up, but you know what? I still love them, and I always will. But thank you guys for watching this video. If you liked it, give it a thumbs up. I'll see you in my next one.